Hi everyone. Uh, today we'll be testing out the low jest water filter. This is similar to a life straw, but it's not. It is the low jest water filter. And it's it's you know one of these. So it's got the little tube you suck on, like so. And it also has a little thing for a tube so you don't have to lay on your belly next to a stream and, uh, you know, get down in there. So you just reel out your hose and suck on it. So, but today, instead of just water, we will be testing it for other things you drink. So see what they taste like when they come through this wonderful filter. Okay, so let's get started. Very excited. Okay, so when we are going to test this now, so what I did, according to the manufacturer's instructions, we need to suck clean water through this in order to prime the filter. So I have that, so we'll do that first. And put it in the water. Mmm. Delicious water. Straight out of the filtered uh, water dispenser from my fridge. So, really good. I'll let it drain out. And then you're always supposed to like blow Blow this back out. Ugh. And then get all the water out of it. And then you can store it. Like so. You know, put the caps on it, put it in your your bag so that you can have it for next time. For when you want to go out on an adventure and drink out of a pond. So this clean water put aside. Now our next Thing that we have are different drinkable items that I want to run through this filter and see if they come out clear just like water because apparently this filter is amazing so let's see if it actually will uh, I don't know let's see let's let's look okay so here's a jar nice little per canning jar I have several of these different sizes because that's all I could find um, I also have Sunny Delight, which is my favorite drink. I really love it. Okay, it's not my favorite drink. It's my favorite non-alcoholic drink, which, you know, it's good. So we'll be having a little Sunny D test. I also have Langer's Apple Cider, also one of my favorites, non-alcoholic drink. And then we have Diet Shasta Cola. It's Shasta, it's Diet Cola. You know, it's not. Yeah. Anyway, and then we're going to try some delicious Lining Kugel Summer Shandy in that. In fact, I'm probably going to have another one for later. So, probably, <laughs> I know I'm going to have another one for later. Okay, so let's get our experiment started. Let's start with. Sunny Delight, yeah, because it's delicious. So I've got my little canning jar. Let's pour in a little Sunny Delight and see what our water filter does to it, if anything. So I know you won't be able to see if it's clear and delicious, cool water um, on the camera, but it will be inside my mouth. So I'm actually going to, um, sorry, spit it back into this jar so you can see it. Yeah, I know. Gross. So here we go. Oh, I also have a roll of paper towels because I'm messy. So let's put a little paper towel down and then put in our straw and suck up some delicious Sunny D. The delight of children everywhere.
Mm. Wow, that took out a lot of the orange color. You can see a little, the difference between this and this. So it is filtering color and it doesn't have that delicious sunny D tang anymore. It's just got a, mm, a hint of orangey delicious water. So let's try that again. Mmm, it's not too bad. All right, let's suck up some more of that delicious Sunny D. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so noticeably different in color, but it didn't take it all out. And I still have the sweetness and the hint of orangey deliciousness that we all love about Sunny D, but it is lighter in color. So it is, it is, um, it is taking stuff out. And the other thing I wanted to note is that it is extremely hard to suck Sunny D up through this straw filter rather than water. So if your water in the pond is really, really muddy, it might take a little extra suck power to get it up through the tube. But it is actually doing its thing. Now let's blow it out. I know, attractive. So let's get that out of there. And now I'm going to try to clean this a little bit with some clear water, which is the tap water out of the fridge. Mmm. Mm hmm. Sunny Delight flavored water. That's that's nice. Mm-hmm. Okay, that doesn't taste like Sunny Delight anymore. So that's pretty cool. It's holding all of the um, Sunny Delight stuff in the filter, even after, you know, filling it full of it. So I'm going to blow it back out. <laughs> it's really hard to blow that back out. Oh, and it's got a little bit of sediment in there from the Sunny Delight, which... No big deal. No, too worried about about worried about that. Okay, so I've got a fresh spit jar, and what I'm going to do now is try the apple juice. So, the apple juice, I would imagine, is going to be similar to the Sunny Delight, but um, you know, uh, not as dark. Okay, in goes our filter into the apple juice. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Okay, so lighter, but not as apple-y tasting. It tastes very much like water, but the dye or the coloring of the apple juice and the Sunny Delight make it dark. So, but the water, it does, it's not as sweet and it's not as dark as the, the uh, regular apple juice. So let's blow this out. Oh God, I'm gonna pass out. Set that aside. Suck a little more water through here. Mm. Yeah, I don't get a hint of uh, apple juice at all. Blow it out. 
pretty amazing. Okay, let's try Diet Chasta Cola. Why not? All right, in my next jar here, I'm going to pour that spit jar, ew, sorry, into here so that I have a receptacle. And then we'll pour in our delicious Diet Shasta Cola. Let's see what that does. Just like that. Pretty dark. I, I wonder what it'll do. Let's have a look. So put in our tube just as before and suck away. Mm-hmm. Okay, so noticeably lighter. I really can't see that. Let me suck a little more up in there. Mm. Okay, so it's getting out a lot of the color. And it's it doesn't taste like Shasta Cola. It just tastes like a, a little watery sweet, you know, like that. Pull it out. Okay, so that's the Shasta Cola. Boy, this thing is working great. I imagine you took it out the pond. <laughs> See what that's like. Okay, that uh, sucking the water back up to I got a lot of sugary taste, so it was trapped in the filter. Okay, blow that out. Now, let's try my favorite beer, which is, you know, delicious. I'm getting around that. I mean, I love it. So, take this and just kind of wipe it out a little bit. Okay, so Lime and Coke, sorry, Lime and Coke Company. Line and Google, Summer Shandy, delicious, <laughs> convenient twist off cap. So let's pour a little of the Summer Shandy in here and see what it tastes like. All right, put it in the straw. And here we go. Oh, sorry. I didn't spit it back out. Because it's beer. <laughs> it's a crime to spit beer out. Anyway, I can assure you it tastes just like beer. And uh, with a little hint of Sunny Delight, apple juice, and a little bit of Shasta Cola. <laughs> it was really good. So, you know, you can't go wrong with my Cola. It's really good. So, mmm. Hmm. It actually tastes better through the filter. So. <clears throat> this might be perfect. Yeah, that's really that's, that's really good. Sunny Delight and Light and Bubbles. My new favorite drink. My favorite non-alcoholic drink mixed with my favorite alcoholic drink makes beautiful. So anyway, that's it. Um really great little item. It works wonderful as many of you have know who have tried one of these uh live straw type devices this one is made by low jest it's water filter it's good for like i don't know a lot of uses and 
um, you can actually attach it with a hose to a water bag. It says, I'm not sure how that would work. I will try that later in another video. Okay. Well, thanks very much for joining me today because I had a lovely time and so much fun. And please, uh, if you enjoyed this video, I will do more. And please um, like and share and subscribe because there's going to be more. I have a lot of, a lot of things I want to play with. Okay, well, thanks very much. Goodbye.